hey, you know MSG, the flavor enhancer that's found in certain foods like canned vegetables, some Asian cuisine, processed meats, and the like? Well, in this piece, I'd like to briefly describe to you a bit of science describing MSG's role in spiking insulin. Yep, that's right, the fat storage hormone. But you might be surprised by the overall conclusion of the data. If you're interested in getting a science-based answer, stick around. Learn Your Body, a science-based education. MSG, or monosodium glutamate, is a flavor enhancer, and there's this simple study wherein researchers decided to measure insulin release when people were fed MSG or placebo, meaning they didn't consume MSG. The researchers told the participants of the study to consume 75 grams of glucose to spike their blood sugar, and therefore their insulin levels, and measured the difference between the MSG consuming group and the non-MSG consuming group. They found that although the insulin levels weren't massively elevated in the MSG consuming group compared to the placebo non-MSG group, there was still a slight overall increase in insulin release with MSG. So does that mean that MSG stimulates insulin then? Well, one could argue that it does, but the issue here is how much. And I don't mean how much insulin, but how much MSG did they consume? The researchers gave the participants of the study 10 grams of MSG, but if you were to check how much the average person consumes, it's between 300 milligrams and one gram. So the researchers gave 10 times the high end of the average consumption, and they witnessed a barely detectable increase in insulin. So this data, once contextualized, offers some sobering news. MSG may have an effect on insulin, but that effect is barely detectable at 10 times the normal consumption levels. So is it a worry? No, not by this measure, insulin. I hope this proved informative, and I hope that you feel you have a science-based answer to the question of MSG on insulin secretion. I hope to have the pleasure of speaking with you in the near future. Cheers. Cheers.